I've ordered fish online a handful of times. Recently, I tried a store that I had not previously ordered from. In this video, you'll get to relive my experience ordering from Goldfish Island. Hi there, it's Connor. So I've been wanting a friend for my goldfish for quite a while now, and we haven't seen any good ones in stores. I recently saw an adorable one on goldfishisland.com that really caught my eye, and I've been wanting to order from them and try them out for quite a while now. In this video, I'm gonna walk you through the full experience from ordering the fish, to unboxing it, to how they are doing a few weeks later. I want to start off showing off the website I ordered from. So here it is, goldfishisland.com. Now it's very professional looking, which I really enjoy as not all online fish stores are, unfortunately. On their website, they sell all kinds of fancy goldfish, also some medications, food, and water products. Most of the site is what you see is what you get, which means they show specific fish and you're ordering that specific fish. They do also have something called you pick where it's groups of the same type of species all looking similar and you can request certain features like a big wen, squishy face, and they will pick out a fish off the batch and they will send you a picture before you order it and you can accept or request a repick. Now they upload weekly on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And for each species on the what you see is what you get, they give a size, gender, and then data on the last health check date. Other stuff on the website that I like to see is I do have very good information on shipping and the quarantine process to go through step by step. And they pretty much answer all your questions. They also do have um, easy ways to get in contact with them if you have additional questions, but I think they really answer everything, including days they ship on, how they ship, et cetera, et cetera. Now last, here is the Aranda that I specifically ordered. And as you can see, it showed the size of them, the gender, and then the last date that their health was checked on. Now here is when the fish actually came in and I do the unboxing. So it came packaged very well. It has very clear arrows to indicate which side to keep upright. There are styrofoam on all the sides around the bag for protection and to keep the temperature stable. And so when I opened and pulled the fish out, right away I saw them moving, which is a good sign. I like to see them active after shipping. They were shipped in medication. As you can see, the water is blue and this is likely from methylene blue being in the water. They also included a heat pack on the bottom, which felt was a nice temperature and it wasn't too hot, which was good, especially for a goldfish. Now, after unboxing, for my initial thoughts is I acclimated them over an hour and then once they did enter the tank, they were very energetic, moving around, looking very healthy. So that's very good. No real signs of stress outside the uh, just being shipped. They ended up eating that night, which is very good. And they are just swimming around, uh, living energetically. And they looked exactly like the pictures shown on the website. The black did seem a bit faded, but this could just be due to stress from shipping. So we'll see in a few weeks if it gets darker or if it stays more of a grayish. So here I want to do a final review. So here you'll see the fish a few weeks later after I got them looking very healthy. Everything was successful. Um, the colors came in a bit more too. And just overall, it was very successful and they're swimming around healthy and doing great a couple weeks later. So my final thoughts on the experience, everything went completely well. There's really great communication from Goldfish Island, which I really enjoyed. The whole way through on the order, you got to see our process and where it was at. It did get delayed about a week because I ordered right before Black Friday, but they had let me know when it expected to ship and they had expected to. And they also update when your fish is in quarantine for a couple of days before shipping and kind of update you through the whole process, which is very nice. For the price I paid, it's about kind of average what you expect to pay for a high quality, fancy goldfish like this. So the price of the fish was 190 plus about $50 shipping. But I did get a decent amount of discount in total. I probably saved about 25%. I got a 20% off coupon. There was just a deal going on then. And then also just for signing up for making an account, I got another $8 out in total. I ended up getting um, a little over $50 off just um, for deals they had. And I'd say normally on the website, a lot of times they do have some type of deal going on. 
So I would definitely look out for that to see if you can find a deal for when you get them. Now, mine did take a little over a week to be delivered because there was Black Friday and Thanksgiving and such. They didn't want to ship it out over the holiday, but I would expect to receive it about three days after you order. Now, obviously it depends what day you order, but generally what they do is they'll have it in quarantine for about one to two days and then ship it out and you should receive it the next day after that. And I use the overnight FedEx option. Um, there are a few options though. Now I'll wrap it up here, but if anyone has any questions about the whole experience, please let me know. I'd be happy to answer. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed seeing the whole experience of ordering from Goldfish Island. And if you did enjoy the video, please give it a like. It helps others find it and consider subscribing to my channel. It's very appreciated if you can. But anyways, thanks for watching and I'll catch everyone next time.